Hey, can you set us up down here? Oh, easy there, pal. We just started our shift. Attention, K-9 unit. We got an 866 in progress at the park. Over. Chief, why are you using the walkie-talkie? I can hear you fine. Fine, let's not use any of our police equipment. So, uh, you got any steroids? Oh, you know it. I can make you huge. Oh, I want to pump my guns. I want to rip my pecs. I want to shriv my nards. Nards, that's what we needed to hear. Freeze! Ah! <laughs> Nobody ever freezes. Might as well just say run. Catch me if you can, little Bow Wow. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice work, partner. Quack, quack. You stand accused of giving hope to scrawny young men. How do you plead? Guilty. Of being innocent. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm afraid because of this improperly filled out police report, I have no choice but to let you go. Case dismissed. Oh, <laughs> don't worry, dude. I'm going straight. Straight to my customers to sell more drugs. <laughs> Listen, man, you gotta let it go. Relax for a couple of days with your family. Come back fresh on Monday. I can't believe it. My own dog bit me. Now that he said it tastes the human flesh, the dog will be a slave to its succulents. Look at him eyeing me. He knows I taste best. Don't blame the dog, folks. A cop's life is so intense he has to channel it somewhere. Me? I knit violent imagery. Pretty grim, huh? No. I love Santa's little helper, but I don't know if we can have him in our home anymore. Mom, you can't send him away. He's a dog, not Grandpa. What if Santa's little helper stops being a police dog? Then he can get a non-violent job, like barking songs on novelty Christmas records. You can do it, boy. <laughs> no, boy, that's Hanukkah. Forget it, kid. He's a cop now. Well, I bet he can't resist this. Fetch, boy! My God, I've lost him. Homer! <laughs> oh, relax, Marge.